Globally, approximately 313 million surgeries were performed last year, many of which require general anesthesia. Under-administration can cause unintended intraoperative awareness, wherein patients are partially awake but unable to speak or move. Such incidents sometimes result in long-term psychological trauma. Over-administration can cause cardiac arrest and sometimes death. To prevent such instances, the ventilator and vaporizer functions of the anesthesia machine require routine testing to ensure patient safety. Here is an example from Anesthesiology, the official journal of the American Society of Anesthesiologists. A healthy 36-year-old woman underwent surgery on her left arm. A desflurane vaporizer was set to 3.5% to maintain anesthesia. After five minutes, the patient became oxygen deficient and displayed abnormally slow heart activity, followed soon after by cardiac arrest. The EKG monitor indicated that her heart had stopped. An epinephrine injection and an external countershock restored circulation. The patient was sedated and transferred to the post-anesthesia care unit for observation for recovery. What happened? An x-ray revealed an accumulation of fluid in her lungs. An analysis of the equipment revealed that the vaporizer control dial was cracked internally, causing desflurane to be administered at a much higher concentration than indicated. The patient had received 23% desflurane rather than the intended 3.5%. Had a concentration check been performed prior to the administration, the faulty vaporizer could have been removed from use, preventing injury to the patient. An anesthesia concentration tester such as vapor would have shown that the true concentration being delivered in the gas stream was much higher than the concentration indicated by the vaporizer dial. Fluke Biomedical believes in patient safety first. Using the VT900A Plus Vapor, we empower our everyday heroes to focus only on protecting lives.